It's Clan. This will be a video chart on ticker symbol MDGS. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. I'm not sure what I mean by 30 minute. I do offer an explanation video at that link. Quite the eventful day on this one, not only from the price action standpoint, but you look down here at the volume and well above average volume on the day. So a lot of eyeballs on this one moving forward. So let's map out some levels of support and then we can talk areas of resistance. So to summarize today's price movement and more so kind of just a general technical perspective, you know, just a general kind of trading jargon standpoint, this is what we would call a gap and trap. What do I mean by gap and trap in case maybe you're new? Well, on Wednesday, the price closed right there. And then this morning, the price opened up there. So known as a gap up. And in this situation, a very big gap up. And then after the opening bell rang, the price made a little bit of a movement right there. And then this is where things get savage because there is a bunch of poor souls buying up around that area. And then you can see from there, it was just basically all selling the rest of the day. So that was the gap and trap that has taken place. And now that also brings about what I would definitely consider a muscled area of support moving forward. And that's down here at $2.25. Why is 225 so important? And I'm not saying at all this is what's gonna actually happen, but just for explanation's sake, if the price were to come down here, behave in that manner, and then continue on down, what would that be doing to the price? That would quite literally be putting the price right back inside of this big old range that it just broke out of. And I mean, not to insult your intelligence, but price movements that go back to where they were, not exactly a sign of true power, true strength, or anything like that. Now, again, I'm not saying that's what's going to happen, but that is why, in my mind, that level is very, very important. Now, if the price does decide it wants to try to work its way back upwards, first key area of resistance to watch is going to be right here at $2.75. And then after that, really nothing until up here around $3.20. Now, I'm not saying the price is going to shoot straight up to that area, but my point here is just looking at the chart. There just really isn't any other data points that suggest areas of resistance. So it's definitely an interesting setup moving forward. But yeah, things are looking a little, little shaky right now, but we'll see if the price can try to get things turned around. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I want to invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too, good, way too good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.